They were taught about love. If he makes you feel this way, he's the one. If he does this for you, he's a keeper. And the reason why women were never taught that is because it takes women out of their comfort zone. Right. And we've always been taught that relationships should, should always center around the woman. This is a very dangerous ideology because it neglects the importance of respect for the man. At least we can all agree on that. Respect builds trust. So if you don't respect him, he will never trust you. Love, on the other hand, is a feeling of affection towards someone or something. I just have a lot of feelings. This is why you can love a car. You can love a house. It's an emotion. And like all emotions, it can be very fleeting. It changes. I've changed. I think. I'm maybe a little... Respect, though, is accepting someone for who they are, even if it means that they're different from you and you don't always necessarily see eye to eye. Respect is accepting someone for their own individuality. I pure, straight, hate you. But God damn it, do I respect you. It's very rare that a man is accepted for being a man, and that's why respect to a man is essential. Contrary to popular belief, love is not an action word. I could love my car and still get rid of it. I could love my home but still sell it. The same way a woman can claim that she loves you but still cheat on your ass. Damn. I, but I can't claim to respect you and treat you any kind of way. Because if I say I respect you, that means that I, have, I now have a moral obligation to treat you right and do right by you. And this is why a lot of women can blatantly disrespect a man but still claim to love them. Yeah, isn't that crazy? When you love someone, you're operating out of a place of emotions. But when you respect someone, you're operating out of a place of pure acceptance.